and welcome back to Tukuza Inspire Refresh Connect. We are at JCC, uh, Jubilee Christian Church, Nairobi's Church of Excellence. The Daughters of Zion Convention is happening and uh, an amazing service uh, this morning. Uh, Cindy Trim, um, Reverend Cindy be, Trim, yeah. will be ministering uh, today during the service. However, if you can get an opportunity, run here and I'm sure you'll be blessed. But we on my testimony. My name is Anthony Dema. My name is Candy Ashitiba. And DJ Krober, the master record selector. Uh, yes, and we're just sharing with Pastor John Isaji, amazing testimony. So here you are, uh, Pastor John Isaji. Hapa uko, umepelekwa ICU. Yes. Uh, I mean, uh, something has already happened, and uh, you're wondering, where do I go from here? Ulipata ufamu bada mdagani? Ulipata ufamu bada ya kama mwezi mwonja hivi. Wow. Saa hapo bada mwezi mwonja ni kanza kujijua, ni kanza kujua watu, ni kanza kusikia, ni kanza kuongea. Lakini touch haiko imerudi, sensory haiko imerudi mm -hmm. Kutembea kukua ni singeweza Kwa kitanda ulukuna lala tu unapenduliwa Usipopenduliwa ni paka siku hile mtu atakuja kupata ya kupendue So singeza kufanya chochote on my own So kila kitu nikuwa nafanya nikio kwenye kitanda So nikaambiwa ya kwamba Nitaweza kutembea after 5 years Kulingana wow. na doctor's report Kuna daktari mmoja pala likuwa na ntia moyo Sana likuwa na niombea Anetua doctor Zeuri Kwa nakuja na niombea na nimbea utatembea usijalize sajari tumefanya Auje umia wewe mm. Kiangalia migu zako zote ziko zitarudi Mikono ziko zitarudi So nikajitia moyo nikajua enyewe Kulingana na picha nye niliona kwenye lile gari Na vile niliona vile Angela yuko na wengine wapo Mimi ni mujiza mm. Kwa hivyo hapa ni kipindi tu ni napitia Lakini ni takuja kupona mm. So hiyo ili ntia moyo sana Na nikiwa ta kwenye hospitali nilikuwa najua ndatoka Mm -hmm. So after hapo sasa ni kambio ni pelekwe spinal injury Nairobi spinal injury ya kukuwa oh, na nafasi Napajua Yes, hapo mm. Rose Avenue mm. Ikawa ya kwamba kuna nafasi kumejea Lakini nafasi ikapatikana So kutoka kijabe ni kambio na pelekwe spinal injury Lakini kauliza wale wajama wa St. John Ambulance Mimi nimekuwa kwenye hospitali Spinal injury tena naenda kwenye hospitali Kwani sijia paona mm -hmm. Mina amini ni kama wawe maliza kazi Niende nyumbani so ganiambia pana ni kawambia ni mekata na taka kuenda nyumbani Siendi hospitali nyingine <laughs> Uka na Mimi nipelekeni nyumbani uh -huh. So tuka kwenye ambulance wana nipeleka Lakini nika, nika zidi tuku insist nipelekeni nyumbani Nika uliza spina injury nina kufanya nini Waka naimbu nina kufanya counseling Rehabilitation Alafu rehabilitation uh -huh. Siju ni nika Iyo tu ni kawambia kuna dawa Kuna nini <laughs> eh, Waka naimbia hapana Nika kawambia basi <laughs> Daktari ya shama liza yake uh -huh. Kenyo baki ni kazi ya mungu Kwa hivyo mimi sitaji kuenda kupata counseling, mimi ni meokoka, na najua ni kazi ya mungu, ni naamini ni mungu amefanya hii kazi. Kwa hivyo sitaji counseling, counseling ni naitaji ni mwini ombe tu. So hapo tuka change, waka nipeleka nyumbani. Waka nyumbani kapsa. Eh, wali kubali, nasa kani mekataa mindi omgonjwa, weo usiki vile mina sikia. Kutanlazimisha ni ingeo sipitali nuki yangu. Eh, so, mindi omgonjwa, mindi omgonjwa haji hata hivyo. Kama nige kwa wakufa, nige ena na wenzangu. Lakini hivyo mungu wa merusu ni ishi. Na mimi. Sasa ni imani yangu hapa sasa wow. Ni mambo na imani hapa mm -hmm. So nikapele kuwa nyumbani Nilikuwa naishi gorofa fourth floor Kumbuka majirani wakaja Kunibeba na hiyo na machela mm -hmm. Waka nipeleka paka kwenye nyumba mm -hmm. Nikalalishwa kwenye, kwenye kiti tu sasa hapo Nikao nikulala nikulala Lakini kiwa pale Mi nikuwa na furadu Hada nikiona watu wanauja kuntembelea wana, Wengine wana, niuzu, wana uzunika na shanga mm -hmm. Na shanga kwa nyo na uzinika wengine ya kipole, ya kipole Na shanga umbra nge niambia maze you are well Anganambia umepona Anamaliza life Anamaliza life umbra kwa mbia kipole ya kimumia Ya kipole hapa Na ndio misipedagi mtu kwa mbia mungine pole sana Moyo, kutia moyo ni kwa mbia maze unaweza yote karika buwana Utatembea, utatembea siku moja Yu ndio kitu umbra na itaji sa hiyo So hapo hapo ni kanza Ni kajua mimi ni taanza kufanya mitu pole pole Ni kapele kwa spana injari laki Tera kaizizi, eh, nikapeleka, nikawambia mi nenda tuku ufanya check up na nirudi Kani nenda spana injury, niliona watu wa meumia ndugu yangu mm. Watu wawana migu, watu wawana mikono, azifanyi, azifanyi nini Zangu wataka azifanyi zote ziko mm. Yu ndilikuwa difference yangu mina wao wow. So nikasema mimi nifanyini tu physiotherapy, nirudi home mm. So nikasema atakuwa na kuja, nilikuwa nenda hapo physiotherapy Na narudi nyumbani, physiotherapy narudi nyumbani, na pelekuwa narudi nyumbani So from there healing yangu ikaanza, mm -hmm. ikawa ni process Apo apo nikaanza kusimama 
Kali ni Rudi Kijabe for check up wakapata nasimama hata walishtuka. Ustali mzima wakaja kushukuru Mungu kwa sababu yako. Kwa sababu yangu. Wakasema wow. kabisa tumeona matendo ya Mungu. Kama unaweza simama ni Mungu. Amen. Na hapo hapo nikaanza kutembea na wheelchair. Nikatoka kwenye wheelchair, nikaenda yeah. kwenye crutches. Mm-hmm. Nikaanza kwenye crutches, nikaanza kute nikarusha hata crutch. Nikasema zina haja na hiyo crutch. Mm-hmm. Unajua maswali nilikuwa najiuliza na ambia Mungu, mimi nimezoea ma3. Sasa ndakuwa na ile ma3 na wheelchair aje. Ni class level nilikuwa nauliza Mungu. Nasema mm-hmm. mimi nimezoea Nairobi una hustle hapa na pale, maisha itakuwa aje. Kwani uliniokoa niteseke? Uliniokoa nije nipitie shida gani? Ungeacha hata ningeenda kupumzika. Mm-hmm. Because for me to die is gain and to live is Christ. So Sasa nikasema nitahamuka siku moja. So nikaanza kutembea, nikaanza kutembea, nikaanza kutembea. Sensory karudi. Wow. Touch karudi. Mm-hmm. Kila kitu ikarudi. Sasa za size inaanza kutembea na niposa sasa na ubiri injili na nasema Mungu anaweza na haya ni matendo ya Mungu. Amen. Yes. Wakati bado ilikuwa ina happen ulikuwa ICU. Wakati bado ilikuwa ina happen nilikuwa nimetoka nilikuwa ICU mm-hmm. wakati bado ilikuwa ina happen na wakati huo sasa hata sikujua Hata ile function yake ilikuwa ile wanamziki walikuwa wamekutana mm-hmm. nilipata tu kuisikia lakini ikiwa pale hospitali nilipata maono na hata before that time nikaambia watu nikaambia tafadhali kama kuna kwa MC anaongoza hiyo event mwambie watu wasilie mwambie mm. watu wa celebrate because Angela amemaliza kazi ameenda kupumzika kazi ya Mungu haina makosa kwa hivyo tusilie wacha tushukuru Mungu kwa yale ambao yametendeka so mm-hmm. lakini nilisikia watu watu walilia sijui it was nini 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 hiyo nikasikia imeniuliza bado unajua mm-hmm. ukiona watu wanalia sasa hii ndio narudi kwa fact eh hey, kumbe tumeumia kumbe ni kubaya eh hey, kumbe ni kubaya <laughs> lakini ukisikia watu wanakutia wanashukuru mm-hmm. Mungu mm-hmm. unajua Mungu yupo let me ask um, kwa hivyo katika hiyo accident kulikuwa watu watano ndani yes Kwa hivyo survivors ilikuwa ni wewe makori ali survive hapana makori alituacha mm-hmm. kulikuwa na jamaa mmoja ali survive mkongolis e, mchungaji alikuwa anaitwa Shima yeye ali survive yeye alienda Kongo mimi i'm the only kenyan survivor wow. ile alikuwa ni mkongolis so that's why wanasemanga maybe kulikuwa na survivor mmoja hawajakosea but i'm the only kenyan survivor mm-hmm. tatu tulitoka wawili pale watatu wakatuacha kulikuwa na Ken Oluoch ambaye alikuwa ni pia ndio dereva yeye alituacha Wow. Na makuri nilikuwa nimekaa naye hapa nyuma alituacha. Mm-hmm. Yes. In all this pastor. Yes. Ni jambo gani kubwa mbalo umejifunza na which is an incredible to us who are watching today. Katika hali hii wote nimejifunza Mungu yupo. Yuko hai. Angalia anatenda na anaweza. Na nikajifunza zaidi ya yote ni imani ambayo mtu ako nayo. Ndiye na determine viwango vya kuinuliwa na kutendewa katika maisha. Ni imani Mungu anaanza kwanza na imani. Nimeona watu wengi wanangoja sijui kuombewa, wanangoja sijui ku, eh, kufanyiwa kitu tendo fulani ndio waweze kuchange. Hapana. It all starts with the level of your faith. Kama unaamini siku moja utafika kiwango cha juu, mm. inawezekana. Kwa hivyo kwa mimi ni imani, nilikuwa na imani sana ya kwamba nitatembea. Sikuwa na kufa moyo, na sikuwa napenda kuka, kama kulegea na lia nitafute wa mtu aniombea nitie moyo. Nilikuwa naomba Mungu na sema Mungu akodi to my faith utaweza kuninua kutoka hapa na kila kitu unaweza rejesha we ni Mungu wa urejesho na hata niposa nimefungua huduma inaitwa restoration Aha. hope hope and, and restoration, restoration. Mm. yes amen yes any question wow amen. wow <laughs> hey mimi umenibariki how many years ago was that accident 8 years Eight wow. years ago. Yes, yeah, ni eight years. And you've been Fika. working for how long now? I've been working for the last seven and a half. You are kidding. <laughs> yes. In less than a year, I, you are back on less than a year, you are Yes, I was working after that. And some things, yes. Zingawaite mbea. Aingi wai rudi. Unajua kama ningejua imeenda imeenda pia inaanzia hapa. Ningejua imeenda imeenda. Pia kwa sababu brain unataka uretrain again kama mtoto. Sasa kukaa nilikuwa naanza kufundishwa. Na ikiwa pili hivi unakaa for 10 minutes unasikia umechoka unalala. Unakaa. So unajua ni mazoezi, ni mazoezi, mazoezi. So from that brain ikajua lazima nifanye huyu jamaa tembe. Wow. Hey. Pastor Asante hey. sana. It's yes. we are celebrating you. Yes. Thank God that you are alive today yes and that's the reason why you are alive today yes so no no mekua wa baraka kwetu wasikizaji wetu yes and even to the church as as a whole i want yes. you to look into that camera yeah. as yes. you do your last uh yeah. you know just your final encouragement yes then you can pray together with us okay maybe kabla sijefanya my last uh word to you nikasama ya kwamba 
tuko pale Juja town yeah, building inaitwa Vision oh, building inaitwa Sidatel Gift House hapo Juja town na kwanza Antonio tutapenda nishuhudie kwa sababu ya mwenye Sidatel Gift House okay when i went looking for a hall to start a church huyu mzee aliniambia pasi chukua hall naanza kubiri injili hivyo hivyo no cost wow no anything else at your requirements letter id mm. kwanza ulikuwa na ubiri wapi ulikuwa unaitwa nani unajua tuna mambo na kanisa vile imekuwa siku hizi so <laughs> alinipatia na Mr Francis i appreciate you so much thank you for supporting this ministry mm. na all my spiritual sons in the ministry god bless you so much mm -hmm. we are taking the gospel to the next level we are preaching christ who works miracles Amen. so ningeweza kusema ya kwamba uko pale nyumbani labda we ni mgonjwa labda kuna kitu unapitia mimi yangu ilikuwa ni accident yako ni same fulani a challenge in life broken marriage depression hizo zote you can overcome through christ there is no any other life like the life of jesus christ so kama ujampokea yesu kama bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako ninasema ni wakati wa kama huu inawezekana umepitia mengi lakini mpokea yesu kama bwana na mwokozi wa maisha yako na maisha yako yataanza kubadilika nimeona watu wanabadilika baada ya kumpokea kristo mimi nilibadilika kwa sababu ya kumpokea kristo kuna wengine haijawezekana kwa sababu ya imani walionayo na mimi husema hivi katika life life you have to discover your purpose why you are living again ni pasta nilikuwa naambia DJ hiyo wimbo ya uliniumba ni kuabudu mm. ukidiscover purpose yako in life you will free yourself from competitive jealousy mm. ati leo unataka right. kuwa kama antu leo yeah. unataka kuwa krobana kro anointing yake hauwezani yeah. nayo <laughs> na hiyo anointing ameilipia gharama that's right sasa ukitaka kuwa kama yeye pia prepare kulipa double utalipa mara tatu ya ile amelipa mm -hmm. so tafadhali omba tu Mungu akupe ile yako yes. yes and leave your purpose and leave your leave purpose your thank you very much yes god bless you say the there are people probably want to invite you yes. to go and share together with yes, you yes 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 any contact email yeah, yeah i can give my cell phone number Mm -hmm. I have at a line 0732 or 07 Yeah too. Hey Matosha. Ah 0732 And I thank God so much. Na sijika kuna salamu kweli unajua. Tuma. Tuma salamu kwa watu wako. Kamenda watu wangu kutoka kule Ingo, my parents, my mom Pastor Sabet. I love my brothers and sisters. Uh, I love my sons in the ministry Steve Mwangangi, Paul, Pastor Wickliffe, Anne Gakunga. Ay 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 na wengine pale job by the way, uh, 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 Ngongo Kiare, Ernest Kabole, Naomi. Wase wote APA group. I hey. love you so much. <laughs> Thank you for supporting me. Ujumbe ninasema kwamba Yesu anaweza, Yesu anaponya na tukuza ile nusu ya kuona. Nusu ya kuona na it is inspiring. It is connecting with them. Connect you to the next level in life. God bless you. Thank you very much. Mwana wewe. So thank you very much. God bless you. Yes. We are going Going uh, straight to JCC for a live chat service. We'll be coming back at 11. Yes. Yes. And we'll yes. just celebrate. Oh, we'll just come back to celebrate. Ukiona machozi, tunashukuru Mungu. Ukiona furaha, tunacheka. Tutakuwa tunashukuru Mungu. Au sio? Right now, JCC. Let me play a, 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 a song here. Play the okay. 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 song. Yeah. I like this one by Jubilee by Angela yeah. Chibalon. Ah, nice. Oh, ni mesema vibaya. You guys are singing. Badly. Let Angela sing this song. Parle, you tu 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 ne comprends le français monsieur. Yes. Tu comprends un peu de français. Hey. Yes. Communication, eh? Communication, brother. Est-ce que tu parles beaucoup de français? Attends. 